Okay, if you remember when we were out in the field, we had a similar well cap on top of a six inch steel well casing. And we had to remove that to begin our, our installation of the Bison deep well hand pump. What I want to show you here is a close up of exactly how to measure the inside and outside diameter of the well casing. Now, if you look in our brochure, there are four questions that we have to have answered. And one of those questions is, what is the inside diameter? So let's, let's go there first. I'm just going to remove this cover off our little display here. Set that aside. I'm going to take these screws out, unscrew the screws. And now we've opened up access to the top of the, top of the casing. So we're going to take a regular tape measure. We'll work just fine. And we're going to measure the inside diameter of the well casing. So you put one end of your tape against the in inside wall of the casing. And you have to remember that this outside edge is round. So we need to get the largest dimension in that curvature. I'll show you what I've been trying to explain here. We're going to set the inside of the tape up against the inside wall of the casing. And if we just rock the tape back and forth, we want to pick the largest inside dimension. You notice if we're out here, we're about five and three quarters. If we rock it all the way down here, we're five and three quarters again. If we stop halfway in between, it's going to measure six inch inside diameter. So that's a very key measurement. The next thing we want to know is what is the dimension from the top of the ground to the top of the casing of your well. In other words, how much of your casing sticks out of the ground? So very simply, just take your tape measure, set it on the ground, measure to the top of the casing. This particular one measures 19 and a half inches. It's very typical for this casing height to be between 18 inches and two feet. It was a very common measurement. In determining the inside diameter of your casing again, you may have a well that has a well seal on the top. And out the top of that well is, a, is the pipe. And that's the pipe that's supplying water to your home. There may be some wires that come out of conduit and go back down the side of the casing. If that's the case, it's going to be very difficult for you to remove this to measure that inside casing. So we don't need to do that. If you just find a, a cloth tape of any kind, or even a string, and we're going to wrap the tape around the outside of the casing to give me the outside circumference of the well casing. Based on that, I can determine the outside diameter, and then we can determine the inside diameter. And this is, this is something you would do if you cannot remove the well cap from your well casing. So that's an easy step. So don't get worried if there's a bunch of stuff coming out the top and you can't measure the inside. Just measure the circumference, and we can take it from there. 